All right, Shalom, Shalom, Shalom. Kwame Asha Allah. Priest Sabak, H O I, to the chariots fly. My brother on the camera. Kanak. Kanak on the camera. Um, so today, real quick, we just want to come to y'all with an announcement, announcement and introduction of H O I Detroit. We will be opening a chapter of H O I here in Detroit. Um, you know, we just in the in the ground stages right now, and uh, but we will be out here in the city of Detroit, most high willing. Um, we'll be traveling back and forth, helping Brother Kanak and a few other brothers get started, get things up and running. Um, so any of you brothers and sisters in the Detroit area looking to fellowship with HOI, feel free. Contact us, contact me, and uh, we'll set you up on how you can fellowship. All right, like I said, we're in the ground stages now. But we'll be moving things along. Um, there's many camps out here. Uh, and before anybody gets simple, don't talk nonsense about building on another man's foundation. And A lot of you don't even know what that scripture means. That scripture is really talking about taking credit for another man's work. That's what building on another man's foundation really goes into. But there's plenty of camps out here. Now, uh, I think uh, Sakari's coming out here. They're going to open a school. Uh, Watchmen for Israel, shout out to Watchmen for Israel, they're out here, they got a large camp and they, they bring in a lot of younger men, right, which is beautiful, they bring in a lot of younger brothers, so it's work to be done, it's a major city, alright, forget about the media and everything, oh, you know, Detroit is all messed up, our people are out here, alright, they need this gospel, <laughs> they got places like Greek Town, Freak Town, where they all out there bugged out, Turking and, and being demons, they need to be taught and woken up. All right, so um, we'll be we'll be finding new camp spots separate from anybody else. You know, other brothers that are doing the work in different locations. But uh, like I said, the more the merrier. You know, um, there's many camps out here already, so you know, is is just the more the merrier. Some people you gotta understand. A lot of times, you know, we don't. We don't really want to go to cities where there's so many camps already. We we rather go to new cities that don't have the word. But every some people's spirit is drawn to whatever particular camp for certain for certain reasons. And the people ask us, "Can you open a chapter in our city?" I'm like, "Oh goddamn! It's like 20 camps out there already." But you know, the people's spirit flow with who they flow with, just like some of the other camps. The, the, the particular type of fruit that they, they get is what they get. Unfortunately now we have a lot of division, difference in doctrines, so all you can do is do the best and the fruit that the people, the Lord gonna bring to you, he gonna bring to you. All right, so let's go to 2 Thessalonians chapter three and verse one. 2 Thessalonians chapter three and verse one. Because it's a beautiful thing, the more the merrier. Like I said, um, Sakari's coming out here on um, Wi-Fi is already out here. You know, most of all the other major camps, I believe, uh, got a camp. Every, every major city, especially in America, mostly all the camps are there, all right, with a chapter already. All right, that's just, you know, that's how it flows. And like I said, the more the merrier, the most I will bring us together on his time and when he see fit, all right? Uh, Second Thessalonians chapter three, verse one, and it reads, finally, brethren, pray, pray for us that the word of Yahweh may have free course and be glorified even as it is with you. All right, so the, the, the Lord, the word got to have free course. All right, this word got to go out freely amongst the masses. So the more, the merrier. And we're not doing this for a show. We're not trying to step on anybody's toes. We're not trying to show nobody up. Like I said, um, you know, we got our brothers from Watchmen out here, Sakari's out here. Those are some of the camps, you know, uh, that we have a rapport with already anyway. So it's not about stepping on anybody's toes or nothing like that. It's about doing the work because some of the people, they ask for HOI presence. That's all it is. All right, if I, if it, leave it up to me. I Like I said, I want to go to cities where there's really no camps at, where the people need it. You know what I'm saying? But the people need what they need. They're like, we need that HOI presence here, man. All right, so um, this is Revelation. All right, uh, one and three. All right, Revelations chapter one and three. And it reads thus and so. Blessed is he that readeth 
and they that hear the words of this prophecy and keep those things which are written therein for the time is at hand. So we looking at the world, we see in the prophecies, we say this word gotta go out. We need a camp on every damn corner, man. Because the time is at hand. We see like Romans 13, 11, knowing a time that now it is high time to awake out of sleep. So as blessed is he that readeth and understand these prophecies and see that the time is at hand. This work got to get done. We got to flood this, this, uh, uh, um, flood this world with this truth. All right, and we got to spread this gospel all over. And now, as we uh, solidify and lock down different chapters in America, of course, through the spirit of Yahweh Bashim, Hamashiach Yahweh Shai, we're going to start taking it international. All right, because what our people got to be taught all over the globe. Let's get that matter of fact. Matthew's 24 and 14. All right, Matthew chapter 24 and verse 14. All right, this gospel got to be taught all over the planet. Thus saith the Lord, thus saith the Holy Bible. So that's what we're doing, taking it to international uh, territory once we continue to uh, lock down these different cities in America. Matthew's 24, 14. And this gospel of the kingdom shall be preached in all the world for witness unto all nations, and then shall the end come. This word got to go out. Like I tell you in Revelation 10 and 7, we got to finish the work. All right, the gospel, the, uh, the mission has to be complete. It's either 144,000 and the chariots come, or you be a martyr and we'll see, you, we'll see each other in the kingdom. Once the Lord uh, make a second coming, you get resurrected from the grave, beamed up on a chariot, and we see you in the kingdom. All right, so um, to my brothers and sisters in the Detroit area, some of y'all... Um, came out this weekend. Some of y'all came from other states. So as we're out here growing and building and whatever we have going on, if you three or four hours, maybe even five hours drive away, this is gonna be your closest uh, place to fellowship with HOI until we can get a chapter set up in your cities. All right, so um, we giving all thanks, praise, honor, and glory to the most. I'm excited about it. Um, it's been a blessed weekend, man, Friday. Once again, I got to say it again, shout out to Watchmen for Israel. We had a camp with them Friday on a river walk, then Greek Town, then Saturday on a river walk, then Greek Town. And uh, them brothers are doing an amazing job, a hell of a job. Whatever we set up and establish out here, uh, we'll definitely keep uh, the lines of communication and the rapport open with those brothers. But uh, it's time to build on all fronts, Israel. Like I said, the more the merrier. You know, and um, I just want to thank the, the brothers and sisters of Detroit um, for the hospitality, the love, a beautiful weekend, like I said. Uh, shout out to brother um, Kabash and his new wife. The wedding was beautiful yesterday. Uh, we had a great time at the wedding, bringing more Israelite couples and families together. So uh, it was a beautiful weekend uh, here in Detroit. August 7th through 10th, uh, 2020. I'll, I'll um, save this date. And uh, I'm looking forward to coming back out here in a few months. Um, we're going to see how things develop with Brother Kanak and um, whoever else uh, the fruit, you know, starts to gather in. And um, we'll come back in a few, well, I'll come back. Other brothers might come out here um, soon. You know, we'll send a couple of brothers out here just to help out, help uh, build things up. Some senior brothers, you know, to help things flow. Um, so we'll, you know, I'll check back in. Um, I'll be back in Detroit. I'll announce the date or whatever. Not sure when, but um, I'll come back in a few months and see how the progress is and I'll link back up with the brothers and sisters here. So, the, you know, we're excited about this. It's, it's beautiful. All praises to the Most High. And yeah, I was shy. And um, let's get ready to do the work out here in the D. There's souls to be saved out here. Even with all the camps here, there's still more work that can be done. All right, are you want to say anything, Kanak? Uh, yeah. All right. Good. Yeah, for me to go. Yeah, you, you can come right, right over here. Okay. Um, happy to be a part of HOY. Just ready to do the work and just do it effectively. Still have a good report with the brothers from Watchmen from Israel. Still love the young lions and everybody. Just happy to spread out more and bring in more brothers, more older brothers, and uh, just ready to do the work. Okay. <laughs> cool. Call me a shot. Call me a shot. All right. So, um, y'all know this brother from uh, the Hidden Enemy series. Um, 
the most I got a beautiful spirit on a brother um, to, to, to bring his talent of uh, being a videographer to the nation of Israel. And you got to remember, everybody not going to have the same job. When you, when you read 1 Corinthians, the 12th chapter, it tells you about different administrations of the body. All right, let that be some homework for y'all. Read 1 Corinthians, the 12th, 12th chapter. It breaks down the different administrations, helps and different things. So um, the scriptures also, I believe in, in Peter's or Timothy, it tells you neglect not the gift that's in you. So if the most I give you any gift or talent, it can be anywhere from music to medicine. Bring it to this nation and help build this nation. So the, the most I put the spirit on a brother, he has a talent for filming, for editing, for putting together information for our people to show you the curses and different things of that nature. All right, so, um, you know, uh, it's all love. Um, you know, we don't, we don't battle over men and, and, and I'm not coming out here to scheme on brothers from different camps, no. All right, uh, through the spirit and power of the Most High, Yahweh Shai, we don't have any problem building up uh, members of HOI. Not to sound proud, not to toot our own horn, but we would never been the type of camp that need to feed off another camp to build what, a uh, feed off of somebody else. Or I'm gonna join this camp for six months and then do my own thing. And, and, and I'm gonna take about five of them brothers with me, no. All right, we put one brother in a city and through the spirit of the Most High, Yahweh Shah, humbly speaking, that brother gonna build up fruit. All right, well, along with us helping him and you know, things of that nature. You know what I'm saying? So it's not about that. It's about just getting this work done. You know what I'm saying? It's about doing the will of Yahweh Bashem and Mashiach Yahweh Shai. That's it, no more, no less. So um, in closing, once again, I just want to thank the city of Detroit, the uh, the brothers, the, uh, all the Hebrews out here that show love, hospitality. You know, I really really didn't want for anything throughout the entire weekend. Um, you know, we taught, taught good, ate, drank good. You know, um, all praises to Yahweh Yahweh Shai. It was a beautiful thing. So uh, look out for HOI Detroit coming soon. All right, all praises to Yahweh Yahweh Shai. Kwame Ashala, we still got next. HOI to the Chariots Fly. Priest Sabak on the camera. Kanak. Brother Kanak. All praises to Yahweh Yahweh Shai forever and ever. I'm done. Contact me for now. There's probably going to be an email set up, most likely an email set up for Detroit. But contact me now at houseofisraelnyc at gmail.com. House of Israel nyc at gmail.com you want to give any contact information locally uh yeah um see nice films 144 at gmail.com con see nice see nice films the nicest spell with a y right yep c n y c e films at gmail.com see, ni see nice films 144 at gmail.com con so if you want to contact brother kanak because he's going to be boots on the ground locally here for hoi detroit um, contact him at cnicefilms144 at gmail.com. See that nice spell with a Y. cnicefilms144 at gmail.com. All right, and uh, you can contact him and he'll basically, you know, know what's going on out here uh, concerning HOI Detroit. All right, so with that, fam, Kwame Ashala, we still got next. Once again, hallelujah. All praise to you. How about you, Mashiach? I was Priest Sabak. HOI to the chariots fly. HOI Detroit coming real soon. And wherever this, the Lord take us to preach this gospel, we'll be there. Hallelujah. Kwame Asha'ala. We still got next. Bring it out. Shalom. Kwame Asha'ala.